Time to Feed the Trolls, Season 3. Hello, this is Cute Fuzzy Weasel, and it's summertime! Hence why I'm wearing this. Well, actually, I guess it's been summer for a while, hasn't it? Should have known what with the 80% humidity. Anyway, while I'm not roasting outside, I figured I'd come down here and do another episode. I know the channel's been clogged recently with a lot of watches and readings and stuff, and... I've got a lot more of those planned. Actually, I've got a couple of new things planned coming soon. But I figured let's do a Feeding the Trolls because it's been a little bit. So the person we're going to be doing today is not technically a troll, even though she kind of looks like one. Her name's Monica Punk, and as far as I can tell, she, uh... Ah, baby kicks! Ah! Makes art. And it's called a sacrifice, but did you know? Did you know that we're the only species that need money to survive? Anyway, we're going to be doing her video, Why I'll Never Have a Job. Why I refuse to get a job. Wow, the early concepts for the Joker had him really laid back. Uh, takes up too much time. I don't want to deal with people. Then get a job in Washington! Yeah! Thank you! really don't want to have a conversation with things. Uh, you're not shirtless, are you? <coughs> you don't know if you can die out there. Okay... To the best of my knowledge, holding down a position as a cashier at Walmart is not exactly the same thing as joining the Detroit City Police Department. I know I want to say I want to die, but... Yeah, 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 what's that noise? I don't want to die on another person's hands. Again, holding down the ticket counter at a movie theater is not the same thing as being a part of Delta Force. Hello, sir, how can I help you? Yes, we'd like two tickets to Grown Ups 3. Ah! I just don't like customers. Then get a janitorial position. You won't deal with customers then. At least not all the time. Like I do, like when it comes to art. Wait, I'm I'm confused. Isn't that a job? I mean, if you're selling art already, isn't that, you know, what you do to earn money? And so that is your job? I mean, like, me personally, I'd rather just give my art away. If I can sell it, I can sell it. But, um, I just, I just don't want a job. But if you're selling your art to make money, then you've got a job. Like, I don't have a physical job to drive to, but that doesn't mean I don't have a job. YouTube is how I earn my money, so... This is my job. I'm getting a little confused as to what you mean when you say the word job. Are you using the literal interpretation of job, where it's a position that you hold or something that you do to make money? Or are you using a more existential definition where you're saying a job is any soul-crushing 9 to 5 that you have to go to but you hate? Because by that definition, a lot of people don't have jobs per se, but they have jobs. So I think you need to be a little more specific. I think I should always be giving free money. Well, there's your problem, because there's no such thing as free money. I mean, the money's gotta come from somewhere. Even if you're getting it off of welfare, the taxpayers are paying for it. Hell, even if you won the money, there's still a moral and psychological price that you pay towards the sudden acquisition of so much wealth. It actually does affect people. Why? Like, why work for money? You went to kindergarten, right? Okay, uh, we work for money because we live in a capitalistic society. Or we're supposed to live in a capitalistic society. Lately, it's become an oligarchy. But the basic concept of how this whole civilization is supposed to work is you go and work for someone, or you work and you make a product, and then people buy that product from you in exchange for 
some kind of good or service. Money being a good, labor being a service. That's how it works. You work for money so you can then exchange that money for goods and services that you need to survive or in some laid-back cultures so you're able to pursue your own goals and freedoms and such. And that is why you work for money on this planet. Now on Cell Mac 4, it's a little different. Like, why? Why not just have fun and games? This video is real, right? And that's what I'm all about. Um, I really... I really just want to be an artist. That would be a job, right? That's what I really want to do. Um, I don't believe in working. Then you're not an artist. Art is work. That's why they call it a work of art. It's someone who worked and made a piece of art. If you don't believe in working, then you can't produce art, so you're not an artist. That's not me, that's the dictionary. The only place that I want to work at is Hot Topic. Oh! <laughs> I've misinterpreted this video the whole time. I've been treating this person like a person, not as a vampire. Silly me, I free. Okay, so this is what happened to Ebony Dementia Raven Way. Wow. Hogwarts really did not work out for you, did it? And I'm banned from working there. How the fuck do you get banned working from Hot Topic? Because back when the local mall where I live was still a mall and not a giant carcass, there was a Hot Topic there. And I kid you not, an employee took a dump in the middle of the store and they were still working there. So what the fuck did you do? I tried to get my band undone. But I just don't know how to do it. Well, I can only imagine letting the rage-infected monkeys out in the middle of the nail polish area at least warrants an apology. Um... That's the only place I really want to work at. Well, if you like working for Hot Topic, why don't you try working for a company that's like Hot Topic? Like Spencer's or GameStop. It's been a while since I've been shopping. I don't want to work for any other company besides my own. Well, if you're self-employed, that implies you have a company, so... Then you have a job! I don't get it! I'm self-employed, therefore I have a job! I am my boss! If I fail, I fail big, and if I succeed, I succeed big! But it's still a job! You still have a job! Um... Uh... I'll pretty much be self-employed my whole entire life. If I don't make a dime, I don't make a dime. I don't care. No, it really fucking matters if you don't make a dime. That means you don't eat. Um... Personally, I'd rather my own TV show. What? And that wouldn't be a job? Fuck, I work my ass off and I just have a YouTube channel. I can imagine the shit that I'd be under if I had a fucking television show. Then... And getting paid for that than working? Wait, this is still working! I'm working filming this! I'm gonna be working when I take this thing up into the room to edit this! It's still working! I'm still working! Um... Because I'm an artist and I have so much fun. So you, wait, wait, so you can't have fun and work at the same time? Look, here, I'm gonna go get my school books from, like, fucking middle school. You can take them, alright? Because I think, I think you'll learn something from them about what is and is not work. Um. I don't care about putting food on the table. Okay, tell you what, try not eating for a whole day, and then get back to me on whether or not you care about not eating. Because something tells me you will have changed your mind by then. This is not one of my things. Really? Eat 
Eating is not one of your things. I suppose you find breathing oxygen to be too passe as well. Um. Personally, I can go hungry and die. Tell you what, how about you try not eating for three days and come back and tell me if you still don't care about starving. Something tells me you will have changed your mind. I don't care. Um. I will never have a kid. Okay, not anything really unusual there. Lots of people choose not to have kids. So, um, I have nothing to worry about when it comes to that. Um, I just, I just really don't want a job. Then really don't have one. Stop doing art and do nothing all day and you will have no job. Um, I'm like a housewife. Really? A housewife? That's actually one of the harder jobs on the list, you know? So is this an actual house house with a lawn and everything and stuff that has to be cleaned? Or is this a magical, fantastical studio loft apartment with our help that comes in every Thursday and cleans everything for us and my husband, who is the senator, who pays everything for me and I get to lounge around the house sipping champagne and eating cheese? Pretty much. Um... I, I want to do my own thing. Um, I don't want to have to worry about getting fired. Oh, no, no. When you're self-employed, you worry about way more than being fired. Because that just sucks. I've done it once. And... So if I'm inferring correctly, what it sounds like happened is you had one job, and then you got fired, and you were like, uh, I don't, I don't want to have a job ever. Jobs just aren't for me because Hot Topic apparently doesn't like it when you let rabid rats out in the bathroom. Whatever. It's just not my... not my thing. It's just not my thing if Hot Topic doesn't want to keep me on because I let the manager on fire with my laser piercing. But whatever. Um... I have so many opinions about money, it's not even funny. <laughs> that rhymes. <laughs> Help me. Um, it causes arguments, it causes breakups. Um, it causes you to go hungry. Which is, of course, something I thought you said you didn't care about, but whatever. Um, it causes so much damage. Like, I'd rather eat garbage. Tell you what... Go eat some garbage. Pretty much. Um, I don't care if I'm homeless. Tell you what, go be homeless. Ever. Um. I don't really, I don't really care. Um. Such a likable person. If I'm homeless, I'm not going to bring a girl into my homelessness. Um, but, uh, I just have a different view. Yeah, clearly. Um, I believe that I should get paid for my grades. Um, I believe I should get paid for education. Okay, look, I personally believe that all forms of higher education should be free. I believe it builds a better society when people aren't forced to go into debt to go be a doctor. And that maybe we would have a more well-off populace if everyone could get an education without having to sell off a pound of flesh for it. But honey... 
You're asking to be paid for your grades, and just going off of what I'm seeing here, somehow I don't think you would be rolling in it. Yes? I just... You... Don't give a fuck about money. Ah! Well, okay. Um... Alright. Somehow I don't think it matters that much, but whatever. I just don't care. Personally, I have too much stuff. Then sell some of it, or donate it to someone who can use it. So I really, technically, am buying non-stop stuff. And buying is like an addiction. So wait, you're... You, you're, you don't care about money, but you have a buying addiction. This, that doesn't make any fucking sense! How do you not care about your money if you use money all the time? It's like, if you don't care about one, you don't buy a lot of things because you don't use a lot of money because you don't, I don't, like, do you not, do you not care about budgeting or do you not care, like, I don't get your priorities, okay? It's, I... If you're addicted to buying stuff, you're spending a whole bunch of money all the time, but you don't care about where your money comes from. So what? Does, does it your... I... Where do you get your social security from, then? Or do you not care where that comes, or are you using someone else's? I don't... And, but you buy things all the time, but you don't understand or don't appreciate or don't un get the value of a dollar, but... You don't care if you have a job, but you have a bunch of money, so you continually buy things. But if you continually buy things, then you must have money, but you don't want a job. So, where is the money coming from in this circle here? Um. It gives me a headache. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, so money issues give you a headache, so... You don't focus on money, but you just buy things, and you don't care about the long-term consequences. Okay, I get it. You're stupid. Alright, fine. Um, personally, I'd just rather have things given to me, and I'd rather give back. Giving back is work. You don't like work, therefore, you don't give back. It's such a deep, touchy topic. Not really. No, you don't work. You don't give back. You don't have a job. You don't make money. Somehow you're getting money, and you constantly spend it on things. Obviously uncaring as to where the money comes from. It's not very deep at all. I've seen it many times before. It's called not giving a damn, and it normally makes you annoying as fuck. Most people get out of the not giving a damn phase by their late teens, but a few people hang on to it till, well... Till they learn to get a damn, or they become a ward of the state. Have fun being a ward of the state. Um. I just, I will never have a job. Never, ever in my life will have a job. I have too many hobbies to keep up with. I have a job. I play the guitar, I play the trombone. I play the piano, I play the xylophone. In all my research, I have found evidence of none of this. If you guys can give me any examples, though, please list it in the comments below. I would really very much like to find one redeeming quality of this person. Um, I think I'm way too talented to have a job. Um, photographer, um, I give awesome massages, um, there's, 
there's just way too much for me that I'm doing to ever have a job. And it's my choice. It's my choice to go to work or not. The whole thing. Proceed. I don't care if I had a dime to my name. I don't care either. I, I just really, I don't care. And I'm, I'm one of the lucky ones that gets free money. Ah, I see. You're on some kind of government assistance, are you? Hmm. I do hope the agency responsible for whatever check you get sees this video. I think it would benefit them if they knew exactly how you were spending it. I do so much. I have so many hobbies and so many interests that it's like, why not? Why not I get paid? Why should I have to go work at retail and deal with snobby customers? That's a good question. Why should you have to deal with yourself? Why? Why should I have to dare choose to do that? Just because I know how to fold a t-shirt. Please tell me that is not the extent of your skill level. I honestly... don't want to work. And I'm not going to. Can't force me. I'm having fun. Oh, yeah. You look like you're having so much fun wallowing in self-pity on that couch. It's like you just can't contain the excitement! Without working. I'm living a dream. Nightmares are dreams, too. There's so many tons of people that would rather not work. But they have so much to worry about. I have... I have nothing to worry about. No, no, it's not that you don't have anything to worry about. It's that you worry about nothing. Big difference. And I'm lucky. I'm one of the lucky people that have nothing to worry about. Oh, yeah, you... You seem really lucky. I, I technically, I really feel sorry for the people that have to deal with people that love spending money every day. Did, did you, like, seriously just say that you feel sorry for the people who have to deal with you? <coughs> I just... Mom, who is that? But who is that on the piano? Come, the uh, video that you're filming right now wouldn't want to, you know, get back to that. I just. Are you gonna answer me? Who's that on the piano? Fuck you! No, I mean, who's that on the goddamn piano? It's in the video, Monica. Yeah, ask them who's on the piano. It doesn't say. Well, type it in. My head hurts. <laughs> but yeah. Oh, wow, that is, that, how do you, look, you know this whole thing, this whole thing that I do and a lot of other people do, this whole thing where we're, you know, human, you kind of fail at that. A little? 
Anyway, this is Cute Fuzzy Weasel. Um, if you have any trolls you want me to feed, list them in the comments below. And as always, have a good day. I took the bottle out of that thing, right?